Mickey faced the next part of his quest with renewed courage. Ah, the grumpy old oak tree. Like all of Miserable's illusions, he was no friend to Mickey. Oh! gem was finally his. Now it was time for our hero to move on. Into a new corner of the Castle of Illusion ran Mickey. But what was that odd green box? The Jack in the Box, of course! Oh no! And now I'm in trouble! Gem. Mickey's heart swelled with renewed hope, but the quest to save Minnie was far from over. Everything quaked and creaked. Mickey darted hither and yon for safety, but found none. Suddenly, the entire chamber flooded. Had our hero's luck finally run out? You see, this was the lair of the third master of illusion. Seeing double? No, there truly were two of them. Yeah! <laughs> 
Mickey wondered if there were an entire gang of these green-killed guppies. The yellow rainbow gem. Reward indeed for such courage and cunning. Mickey thought of Minnie. Once he had all the gems, Mickey braced himself for the next sugar-coated shock from this confectionery world. He didn't have long to wait. A gigantic red licorice dragon emerged from the melted ice cream. This was the fourth master of illusion. rainbow gem in hand. There were only two more to find. And then, Mickey could search for the most precious jewel of all, his sweetheart, Minnie. Up of the clock tower, Mickey thought the danger of being squished was finally over. Unfortunately, he'd thought wrong. The oafish clockmaker was the final master of illusion. Master's hour of terror was at an end. The final violet gem was Mickey's. Next stop, Minnie. <laughs> was Mickey too late to save his beloved Minnie? Or was there still hope? Beyond the grave, 
Heed my bidding, hear my call. Rid me of this earnest name. Crush his spirit. Be his fall. Attack! You still don't know what my castle of illusion is, do you, Mickey? It's a mouse trap. Return, my fiendish fools. Circle around, ghosts and ghouls. Spin and twist, twirl and whirl. Let your phantom fury swirl. Strike! <laughs> dazed. But for how long? Suddenly, Mickey had an idea. What if he launched the rainbow gem at the witch? It might be his one and only chance. Take that! Time seemed to freeze for a moment before the gem burst into a cascade of rainbow light, filling every inch of the tower. No! But I wanted to be the fairest of the world! It was the cruel witch's turn to be trapped and powerless, encased in the spreading light. The terrible spell was broken. Minnie was free at last, and Miserable wilted and shriveled back to her true form. Minnie threw her arms around Mickey, and as he hugged her, he vowed never to let her go again. Oh! The gym! The castle was crumbling, but Mickey couldn't see a way out. What was this? Miserable was helping them escape? Mickey didn't have time to consider if this was another trick. Ooh. Mickey and Minnie each held on to a broomstick and flew for their lives. <laughs> Miserable had wisdom enough to know when she was defeated and why that was so. She had learned that there's a magic more powerful than any she had ever used. Mickey and Minnie knew it well, and even after what she had put them through, they shared its secrets with her. Now, Miserable's heart was filled with a different kind of magic, the magic of love. Aww. Now, where were we? The end. <laughs> <laughs>